Welcome to the five day English speaking challenge to improve your accent to get a band seven and beyond. This challenge is tailored for people who are intermediate speakers, not for beginners, but maybe you're at the band four, 4.5, even five, and you want to get to the band seven level or higher. This challenge is designed to identify the most difficult sounds in English pronunciation that you might be struggling with and that might be keeping your IELTS score back from getting the score that you need. With over 16 years experience training students on how to speak fluently in English, my name is Matthew, an English language coach, and I've put together a five day challenge to identify all of the weaknesses that you have in speaking English and how to fix them as quickly as possible. If you've ever felt frustrated when people ask you to repeat yourself, or if you've noticed no matter how much vocabulary you learn, you still feel like your pronunciation makes you sound unclear and uncertain about what you're talking about. Well, you're not alone. Many of my students have the same sense of frustration and embarrassment when they're trying to improve their English speaking skills. And if you don't know how to identify the areas of your accent that are preventing you from improving, even worse, these pronunciation problems can make you sound hesitant, which will cost you valuable points in your IELTS speaking exam. But here's the great news. These problems are fixable. The reality is that once you identify the right areas that you need to improve with the right practices and the right knowledge, you'll be able to eliminate your accent barrier and finally speak with clarity, confidence, and fluency. Take my student George, for example. George came to me after months of studying for the IELTS exam and still couldn't break 5.5 in his band score. And after just one week of working on his pronunciation from the challenge, he managed to improve his band score by 0.5 just in one week of practice. As you guys know, the four criteria of the IELTS exam, one, two, three, and four is grammar, fluency, and cohesion, lexical resource, and pronunciation. So if you can remove this problem of pronunciation, you can spend the rest of your time focused on the other three parts of English learning that's going to improve your band score to get to a band seven and above. So let's dive into the details of the challenge and what you're going to get as part of this five day challenge. So how to improve our English accent in only five days? Is that even possible? Of course, we have to break down what is the English accent and how do we create the sounds that a native speaker can create. We all have the same mouth, the same tongue, the same teeth. We just use them in a different way to produce sounds. So day one, we're going to jump into the mean 13. This is the 13 most difficult consonant sounds in English that I have found helping my students improve their accent. I've given you this short list so you don't have to waste time identifying the, the most difficult ones. And on the inside, you're going to have day one, a consonant assessment to find which of these 13 are most problematic for you. So once we jump into this day, the realization you might find is that no one ever taught you about how to use your mouth. So we're going to learn the map of our mouth to be able to understand how to use our articulators. Day two and day three, as you can see, we're going to cover the vowels of English. We're going to cover the 20 British vowels. We're going to touch on the monothongs at the beginning. And what we're going to use for this is the IPA tool, which is an incredible tool to help you identify exactly which sounds you're not able to make and why. One of the major things that's wrong with non-native speakers is that they never get taught that the mouth is really a muscle and it needs to be developed just like your biceps need to be developed and it needs training, regular exercise because often miscommunication and mispronunciation can also happen not because the mouth position is incorrect but because the mouth position and the muscles are too slow to arrive to that position inside fluent speech. So the muscles are basically weak and we need to take them to the gym and strengthen them. Day number four, this is intonation and stress. Intonation and stress, many students find themselves sounding like robots or speaking like this very much monotonous. <laughs> and that's because they haven't yet understood 
intonation and stress pattern on the word and the sentence stress in English. I'm going to teach you and unlock this part of speech, which will be like the music in your mouth, allowing you to feel confident and fluent when speaking in English. And then day number five, we're going to jump into connected speech. A lot of students pronounce all of the words like this in English. And if you spend any time, you will notice that native speakers shorten their sentences by connecting and eliminating certain sounds in words to make their speech much faster going to improve your English speaking speed and you're going to improve your ear for listening to native speakers as you identify what are these connected speech patterns. As an added bonus for taking part in the five-day challenge, you're also going to get access to my mindsets, which is in our incredible classroom tab where you're going to understand exactly the mindsets it takes to become a band seven plus student to be able to speak English fluently and confidently. And we're also going to touch on the RP accent, which is the posh accent in English, how you can actually improve your British RP accent if that's interesting to you. This is just a bonus and a little bit of fun at the end of the challenge. That's the five day challenge outline. And the bonus is you're going to be to be a part of an IELTS fluency clan. What is the IELTS Fluency clan? It is a bunch of people passionate about learning English and want to help each other to be able to improve their IELTS score. So you're going to be part of this community for absolutely free. Be remember to give more than you take. So we have an attitude here of helping, serving and encouraging each other to reach your goals with the IELTS exam. And you're going to be able to get to meet other people for practice, for encouragement, and to share tips and tricks, and maybe even talk about exam questions that previously people have gotten, which is great insight into how to prepare effectively for the exam. You'll also get access to my free content, which I have loads of amazing training tools, techniques, all in my classroom tab. So when you enter into the school platform, check out the classroom and see the amazing free content that I provide for all my students to help them prepare effectively for the IELTS exam. So it's time to take action. Join us in the five day challenge by signing up below, clicking on the link and entering into the IELTS Fluency Clan. I'm gonna get access to all the information, tools and resources to help you improve in just those five days. So remember, you're not doing this alone. You're part of a community and welcome to the Fluency Clan. Click the link below and I'll see you on the inside. Let's unlock your full speaking potential together.